Hey there, everyone, and welcome back to Turning Cards, the show brought to you by the letter M and the number 13. I'm Mr. Magic, and we're going to take a look at another card. Let's see what's on the mat today. Interesting. Looks like we've landed a good one. It's Cathedral of War. Let's take a closer look. Jeez, I'm almost scared to touch this one because I might cut myself on something. Today, oh, ow. Oh, hang on a second. Okay, that's better. Today we're checking out a piece by Kentai Kotaki. And I have to say that I like the concept of this card more than the execution. It's a little too dark and I wish I could see more of what this cathedral has to offer. Also, I think that there must be some kind of mandate when it comes to art and land. The illustrations always look so empty because there are never any people in them. It would be cool to see who worships here. I wonder if they pray to the god of war. Oh! Ooh! Oh! Oh, maybe that's why it's empty. Let's break this down. You can play this card any time that you would play a land. Cathedral of War is a rare, special land, and the oracle text says, Cathedral of War enters the battlefield tapped. Exalted. Whenever a creature you control attacks alone, that creature gets plus one, plus one until the end of the turn. Tap. Add one colorless mana to your mana pool. Next. Cathedral of War is a rare land from the M13 set, and I really like the exalted mechanic, so I think this card is great. When you're attacking with one creature, each exalted source you have gives that creature plus one, plus one. So, if you have a bunch of cards with Exalted, that can bring a game to a quick end. For example, turn one comes into play tapped. Chicken breast, butterfly. Turn two, white mana, cast Knight of Glory. Sauce, mozzarella, grated parmesan, olive oil. Turn three, another white, cast our old buddy Silverblade Paladin, and attack with Knight of Glory for 3-4 double strike. Done. It's gollop of chicken served with sauteed potatoes and red chard. Done. Thanks, but I think we're working on different projects here. Hmm. Another great thing about having this as an exalted source is that it's very hard to get rid of land, so it'll probably be around for a while. This card is so awesome that they had to think of a way to make it less powerful. So the only bad thing about this card is the fact that it comes into play tapped. This can throw off your ability to get other spells played and have mana when you need it. So you're going to want to think about that. Onward! Well, that about wraps it up for another card. Thanks for watching. If you have a card that you would like to see featured on the show, leave me a message in the comments and I'll try to make it happen. In the meantime, I'm Mr. Magic, ending my turn. This land is your land and this land is my land. California to the New York Island and the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me. As I went a walk in that ribbon, Olé. Of